What's up everyone, welcome back to me, Ted Gaming. My name is Roland and I'm very sleepy, but I just woke up and I saw that there's a new Prisma 2 case out. Some new skins, so let's go ahead and take a look at them, discuss a little bit and then just move on with our days because it's a long day today, baby. Here you go, this is the Prisma 2 case. We have 5, uh, 8, 11, 14, okay, 17 new skins. Uh, to be honest, none of none of them are to my liking. Oh, make okay, maybe the disco deck. Whatever. You know what? Let's go ahead and start from the bottom to the top, and let's have a look at how do they uh, they actually look. So we're start. We're gonna start with the Nijev prototype. Uh, not a big Nijev player. I don't know if you guys like to play with it. <laughs> okay, this is the battle scarred. So you can still see. I mean, it's it has a white pattern. That might be that might be interesting to some of you. Let's go with that field tested one. Mm. Now this is more like it. I like the idea. Yeah, I like the idea of the white uh, with the red stripes. I think it looks cool. And even the magazines have a little bit of white on them. I don't know if it's that's the standard for the Nijep because I told you I'm not playing with the weapon. But I like how it looks. The Nijev is a beast that can keep the enemy at bay with its pinpoint suppressive fire. Provided you have the luxury of time to gain control over it. It has been custom painted in white and red. A temporary paint job while its design is finalized. Ugh! All the prices are high right now because it's a new case. So, we had the Nijev. Let's go with the Distress looks quite quite decent let's have a look in game mm, it's a nice copper look to it although I'm not into that but it's quite decent let me see what glove would go I think like with the rust coat knife and so on and so forth maybe I don't know what which glove would you pair this bad boy up with not as bad as I thought it would be to be honest with you a fully automatic variant of CZ-75. The CZ-75 auto is the blah, 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 blah. table, but the very light ammo. Okay, let me see. The copper-colored ceramic finish is wearing away with use. Better with age. Okay. Next up, MP5SD Desert Strike. Battle scarred. Looks like poop. Okay, this is doable. This is doable, I think. Uh, but the prices are the same. Like, well worn is 117, uh, field tested is 177. So, if you want one, you can buy a field tested one, I guess. But if not, then you can buy a well worn one and maybe put a sticker on it or whatever. Now, we're gonna jump from the field tested to factory new. Okay, this is decent. This is decent. Uh, it has been custom painted with a high-tech design in tan and black. Th 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 that's what you call a high-tech design? Come on, man. Come on. Come on. Come on! Okay. On to the next one. Uh, we have the Tomcat. Ooh. This looks dangerous. Battle scarred one. Okay. Not bad. Looks like this is one of those skins that uh, doesn't... The artwork doesn't wear off, it's just the luminosity on it, if it's battle scarred. Uh, so that's cool, if, if, if you're into this one. Uh, it's not quite that expensive, it's a few euros. So let's go from the battle scarred one straight to the factory new one, because as I said, it's only the luminosity that changes. Okay, this is a little bit lighter. I actually like the color, the color pattern, and the pattern also, the little, little cat there. It's quite nice, uh, wouldn't buy it, but it's quite nice. Let's see the description. Its gunmetal base coat has been finished with gold highlights, rear-facing arrows and a mischievous looking cat. Brrr. Next, revolver. Should we even look at this? I don't know. Okay, let's just have a look at the, at the factory new one. I have to admit the handle on this bad boy looks really, really good like uh, yeah I wonder if it's designed like a skull I think 
maybe it's a skull these are the eyes these are the nostrils you can see some teeth and then these ones also from the handle of the weapon i think this looks uh quite interesting again a copper finish to it but the handle is sick it's sick brother the grip of this uh, revolver has been custom painted with the remains of an ancient sea creature yeah well that confirms my theory it, it's a nice looking skin i just don't play with it so it's useless imagine putting effort into doing one of these uh, one of these bad boys and then nobody will ever use it that sucks man but props to the, to the person that made this one it looks good it looks good okay on to the next one awp capillary there's an mp9 with this skin isn't it uh i think it looks like poop oh it's actually not that bad in the battle scar uh four um yeah you always have the option of uh putting uh putting a sticker on it For, let me show you what sticker that skin and this sticker so if you put it on the scope maybe or where the where the uh let me just show you something very quickly let's go for the well-worn one or maybe around here where these end then it's like a wave of nerves from the brain so that can be a an interesting uh, an interesting combination uh the color is okay i like it i don't know what which gloves would you combine this okay so this is the factory new one looks a little bit better but it's still poop so let's move oh let me no 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 let me see let me see the description man come on come on a custom paint job comprima comprised of intra intricate teal and coral veins has been applied okay next on the list now we're getting into the more interesting stuff more colorful stuff desert eagle blue ply blue ply not bad but if i am to get a blue Blue Desert Eagle. I would go for something else, but looks like okay. Let's let's have a look at it uh, in game. Looks like this is one of those skins, uh, like the AOG, that doesn't uh, deteriorate the artwork in the battle scar form. It's just the luminosity. Let's have a look at the factory new one. Yeah, yeah, it's it's something like that. Um, looks like a wood wood finishing you know in one of those camping houses it has been laminated and filled with an ash colored grip and blue side not bad uh, not not that expensive uh, I think it's like what uh, it's a little bit too expensive though for what it is you know I think also like keep in mind guys the prices will go down Okay, let's go and see what the Apocalypto looks like. Yes, mama. Yeah, this is in the battle scarred form shape, so it looks quite good for a battle scarred. Um, but who uses the sawed off? I don't use it, and it's quite expensive. Quite expensive. Okay, let's go from the battle scarred one to I don't know. Let's go for the well worn one. It has a really nice coloring. I always like the light blue and purple color, so this is nice to look at. But you don't use this weapon, so it's a it's a it's a shame. A decomposing hand reaches for a bomb like planet has been custom painted over a purple outer space background oh. next the scarf oh this is a fade scarf or what yeah it looks like it's fade let's go ahead and have a look at it in game yeah it's a fade not bad but nobody uses this weapon so a sunset gradient uh, has been meticulously painted on different parts of the weapon yeah oh 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 ssg okay 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 this is actually interesting interesting the fever dream i was a big sucker for the fever dream when it came out on the awp look at these prices though oh my god okay let's see the belt scarred one not bad not bad okay let's have a look at the uh field tested one which is six euros man six fucking euros for a scout skin oh my god 
no me gusta, no me gusta. I think the AWP looks better. <laughs> yeah, but maybe maybe it's because of the green background of the AWP. So, nah. Oh wait. Mm, no, 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 thank you, no, thank you. So, I'm sure it'll it'll get like really cheap in, with time. But still, but still, it's not for me. Okay, P2000. I don't want to look at this, this looks ugly. You know what, let's just check out the... Okay, this is another one of those skins that uh, deteriorate only in lightning. Let's check out the... Hmm, not bad, not good. It is what it is. A randomized multicolored pattern with a rare four-leaf clo uh, clo clover. clover has been applied. Do you feel lucky? No. Looking at this, I definitely don't feel lucky. Now, I think this is this is my uh, my perfect, uh, my favorite one from the whole case. Uh, the Dark Wing looks cool. Let's take a look at the Battle Scarred one. So the Battle Scarred one looks decent. Uh, you don't really have too many options if you if you are into red if if you are into red loadout, uh, but now you have this option. I think the battle card looks decent. I mean, the only other viable red option you have is like this one. Where is it? The candy apple, and there is the hazard also, but like that's not quite red red. So I think this looks the battle card one looks decent. Let's move up a chad a chad uh, for the well worn one. Yeah, this looks much better now already, and I don't I don't even think you have to go much higher than this Yeah, this is the well worn one. Let's let's have a look at the uh, factor new one Nah, just stick to the well worn one a red and black custom paint uh, job with feathers and other dark details has been applied Okay, brother, whatever you say And the prices on it are, ooh, mamma mia, mamma mia. Okay, let's move on. It's also because it's a new skin, so. And the SG is at its prime right now, so maybe if they will uh, nerf it, it'll be a different story. This looks nice. It looks similar to the Emperor, M4 Emperor. But this is the Justice. Let's have a look at the Battle Scarred one. Not bad, not bad for a battle card skin. Again, one of those skins that uh, doesn't deteriorate its artwork. Let's have a look at the factory new one. It's like basically the same, it's a little bit shinier, but yeah. And the price is on it. Let's see. Oh my god, okay, let's move on. Very expensive. This looks cool. Wait, what? Is this a optical delusion? purple and blue but here it's yellow and purple what's going on let's have a look at the bell card one oh okay this is cool interesting battle card one looks decent oh my god 36 euros let's check a uh minimal wear one yeah same shit different day it has been custom painted using a pearlescent, pearlescent finish to resemble holographic self adhesive vinyl vinyl depending on the light it appears its appearance changes yeah okay you know what this is too much this is counter strike come on come on chill out so we have arrived to the nitty-gritty um, yeah, it is what it is. Let's let's move into it. The AK is expensive and ugly. I don't know what you guys think about it, but I don't think too much about it. Let's see the battle scarred one. Yeah, it's decent. If you're into light yellow, orange loadout, maybe this will help you. Although I wouldn't go for it to be honest with you. There are much better options out there. Uh, let's go for a factory new one. Yeah, the factory new one looks a little bit better, but still it's 
hope I like I appreciate the artwork I'm sure that somebody worked very hard to put this on the skin uh, I'm, I'm just talking about my preferences don't go don't, don't get offended I appreciate the work on every skin okay hard work is hard work whether uh, you like it or not a little bit expensive I'm guessing it'll be much cheaper with time now this looks very much like the leaves M4 leaves when it comes to the color pattern uh, is this one of those yeah okay it, it looks decent in battle scarred form also uh, let's have a look at a battle scarred one okay maybe not okay we can't look at a battle scarred one well that's that's a bummer that's a bummer okay field tested 700 euros. I repeat, 700 euros. Seven hundred euros for this piece of poop. What's this? Mega Man? I think this is Mega Man. Looks like Mega Man. Mega Man, perfect robot. Let's have a look at the factory new one. Perfect robot, Mega Man, Mega Man. Okay. It's good looking. Yeah, it's decent. It's decent. You know what? It's decent. Uh, definitely, definitely not an 800 euro skin. For me, you know, for me. I'm a cheap bastard. Uh, this looks good. I think this Glock is uh, quite nice uh, for what it is. I like the black and yellow. I think the black and yellow combination go uh, goes nicely. The chick on the handle, it's nice, but you're not gonna see most of it when you hold the weapon and you fight with it, only when you inspect it, so it is what it is. Let's see the battle scarred one. Yeah, battle scarred one looks decent. I'm guessing most of people are gonna go for this one. Uh, factory new. Oh, it's much shinier. But it's still the same skin, and you, has, you can see the handle has uh, has painting on it. Menacing bullets and the war maiden in a pink jacket have been custom painted over a yellow and black base. I'd like to to see this skin without the chick. I think it would look better. But that's just me. That is just me, guys. And look at the pricing. Look at this. Look at this. What is this? Is this a joke? Am I joke to you? <laughs> okay, it is what it is, I guess. It is what it is. <sighs> well, there you have it, guys. We have a new skin uh, package. Prisma 2 case uh, skins. These are. This is my opinion about them. Sorry for the sleepy face, sleepy eyes, so on and so forth. I just woke up, uh, I was planning to do something else, but this came up, so I said, why not? Have a look, have a chit chat, don't stop, grab a Snickers. Okay, that's something else. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, let me know what you think about the new skins, man. I don't like any of them. Mm -mm. The, uh, sorry. The SG is nice. Other than that, everything else is poop. But I do appreciate the hard work that went into it uh, for those of the for those that have created the skins. Okay, I do appreciate that, and I do appreciate Valve updating the game, adding new content to it. Did you finish your Shattered Web Operation missions? Because I personally stopped at week five, I think. Uh, the week where you had to befriend a chicken on the death match. That's when I said, okay, this is too much, and I stopped. Uh, it is what it is. Okay, let me know what you think about the skins. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you again next time. Until next time, until next time, until next time, until next time. Stay safe, stay strong, stay clean. Man, I'm freaking sleepy still.